ready to go. She kind of looks like that one actor. That one actor. Mm. Mm -mm. Why would you want sparkling water? <laughs> Trying a new thing. Can you tell? So I stopped using the hair mask that I had because I saw that it has alcohol um, in it. And I don't want alcohol. At least I'm pretty sure you don't want alcohol in your hair products. Um, but so I stopped using it. It was like almost done anyways. And so I just do shampoo and leave-in conditioner. Yo, I don't know what the fuck's going on with my hair, but this is washed. I swear to God. I swear to God. Look at how popular my letter is. Still don't know how to feel about my hair. I took a bath yesterday and it just feels like there's some leftover water in my ear. Um, so I'm just doing the good old peroxide cleaning treatment. I'm just waiting. I'm so spoiled this week with Starbucks. I feel like an amphibian. I'm only wearing this mask because it's trendy right now with the style and the fashion. That's a fucking joke, wear a fucking mask. The only reason I have this mask anyways is because um, it was nicely given to me and I really appreciate that. So, it's kinda nice. I like them. I'm actually like doll jokes aside, I'm, I'm super fortunate that um, I was given this mask. I look disheveled, and that is exactly how I fucking feel. I'm gonna go get boosted. I need to fix my hair first. Let's go get boosted. I don't know what to expect. I didn't get sick from the second round, so I don't expect to get sick for this round. It's time. The perks of getting boosted at Target is that I get to walk around afterwards and get lost. The essentials. What do you guys look at when you go to Target? I don't, like, people probably look at clothes, but I don't look at clothes. I just kind of walk around. If they had a garden center, I would, uh, that's where I would go. The dollar section, that's where I go. I added a tray from the dollar spot to my inventory. There was actually a lot of good stuff there. Um, pillows, metal signs, um, the trays, lots of Valentine's Day stuff. Yeah, that's next. That's next month, by the way. Okay. So yesterday, I get boosted, right? I'm excited. The, the arm starts to feel a little bit sore, kind of like how I got my second dose of Pfizer. So I thought that was all it was gonna be, really, with a little bit of body soreness, because that's how it was the second time. Right? Yeah, um, woke up. The soreness was definitely there in the arm. The body soreness was absolutely there. Absolutely. I had eye soreness too, like my eyes stunk. And then I tried to get up to make soup, right? Because when a bitch is sick, a bitch wants soup. Nearly blacked out, hyperventilating crying, almost throwing up. I had to, I literally hobbled my sore ass to the couch because I felt like I was going to black out. Took my fever, it was 100 degrees, so just barely hitting the fever mark. Horrible, I haven't been sick like that in literal years because I had the flu when I was like nine years old in elementary school. It's not an experience I'd want to experience <laughs> ever again. Or ever. It's not, it's not an experience I would have wanted to experience in the first place. We're using the word experience a lot right now. It got me on my ass. That booster shot, let me tell you. They're saying that if you didn't experience bad symptoms the first two times, you shouldn't expect one this time, but I don't know what the fuck they put in my Pfizer booster shot that made me feel some sort of way this morning. But I took some ibuprofen, I drank a shit ton of water, I got some uh, cleaning done and a little bit of fighting here and there. I feel pretty okay. Just gonna knock back some ibuprofen again. Wash it down with some hot hair. See how the fuck I feel the next morning. So here's the hair update. Um, tried that mask and my hair looks and feels great. I think it still has to get used to it. But for the most part, it's a significantly better reaction than with the other hair mask. Um, it also helps that I'm using the same products 
for my leave-in conditioner and for my hair mask. So, now despite my condition, we did clean the apartment today. It took me a few hours, about four, to recuperate my symptoms you know the the ones from the booster vaccine that i didn't get in the first place we got some cleaning done thank fuck because if we didn't then that would have been like the fourth week in a row we hadn't deep cleaned our fucking apartment bottoms up baby Ugh. i do a dry swallow by the way I hated all of that. I've really been liking chartreuse recently. Okay, so I used to think that pink had some really cute underwear and I looked and I'm not impressed. Victoria's Secret brand of underwear is definitely looking a lot better than pink for some reason. That underwear clip I showed though wasn't Victoria's Secret. That was actually airy and I thought I was walking in a Forever 21. I understand now why I've never been to a crate and barrel. It's just too intimidating for me. I have unfortunately but also fortunately, been introduced to the world, the world of Wordle. Those of you who don't know who Wordle is, I am officially a um, expert on, on one day of uh, learning Wordle because I learned it through Twitter today uh, because I don't know what the fuck. I saw a tweet saying that Wordle was the sourdough starter of Omicron. And I'm like, what the actual fuck's a Wordle? What did I do? I checked the app store downloaded a game named called wordle and i played it and i was like i don't see the fucking fuss of it i have to pay for the next level and then i checked the tweet again under the responses and when someone finally asked hey what is wordle and they explained that it is a website where there's a daily word and you have a certain amount of chances to guess what the daily word is then of course the daily word is whatever the fuck it could be there's no hints until you start guessing so it you'll guess and then it'll give you green It'll give you a green box for the words that are correct and in the right spot, and it'll give you yellow for the words that are for the letters that are correct but in the wrong spot, and then the ones that are just grayed out are incorrect and don't belong there at all. Just to see how many fucking tries you can take to guess the word correctly with just those hints. And let me tell you, it is something it is a whole new world out there for me for games, and I could get addicted, I could not get addicted. Who'll we'll see? if i will do it every single day or i won't do it every single day i don't know i fucking change my underwear you know like i don't know where i was going with that one it's hot and cold for me it could depend i could do it every day or i could not do it every day i could forget and i or i could not forget there's really no telling with me today's word was solar and i it, it was my first time trying so forgive me but i think i only had two tries left before i fully guessed it i know rookie move i have not made it to wordle talk yet but apparently that's where all my friends are finding wordle from and i find it from good old twitter no judgment